Good morning, South Florida. I'm Maribel Rodriguez. And I'm Carly Barnett. Here's a look at some of your Tuesday morning headlines. Breaking overnight, Lauder Hill police investigate a deadly home invasion. This happened at the Wyndham Apartments at 52nd Avenue and Southwest 18th Street. Officers say they found a man dead inside of a unit and a man with a gunshot wound to the leg. The surviving victim told investigators a group of armed men entered his home demanding stuff and shots were fired. That man was taken to the hospital with non-life threatening injuries. Investigators are now interviewing witnesses to get more information. Also breaking overnight, multiple police units on the scene investigating Davies Wendy's. The east and westbound lanes of Griffin Road at State Road 7 are back open after they were shut down for hours overnight. There was also a crash at that location. No word of the two scenes are connected. We've reached out to Davie Police for information. Family, friends, and fellow classmates are mourning the loss of a Westminster Christian School student who was killed in a boating accident. 18-year-old Lucas Alvarez died this weekend after the boat he was in hit a channel marker in the Keys. Westminster Christian School will offer counseling services, and they will hold a special assembly in his honor tomorrow. And a puppy is now recovering from surgery after it was shot in the jaw. Volunteers found the pup this weekend with its jaw hanging open and it took to Animal Hollywood Animal Hospital for surgery. Doctors found a bullet lodged in her cheek and removed it. The doctors also had to remove a large part of her jaw. The dog will spend the next week at the Animal Hospital. Now to look at some of your Tuesday morning headlines. Make sure to join us later for CBS 4 News at noon and get updates anytime on CBSMiami.com.